Hello, hello, everybody, and welcome back to Raft. Uh, we've kind of got to jump in quickly here uh, today because we are literally running into our destination, uh, but we do not have an anchor. Uh, so I need to get one of those built for us real quick. Um, and definitely on our list, uh, as soon as possible, is going to be making a permanent anchor for our boat and we might be in a little bit of trouble cuz I think we are out of planks uh, hopefully maybe this barrel has some luckily it seems like we are more or less stopped here um, all right there's one. Oh, and there was another plank perfect uh, throwable anchor there we go and let's get that in our hotbar. And chuck that overboard just to make absolutely sure that our raft does not go anywhere. There we go. All right. Well, now that we are absolutely certain that our raft is uh, secured here and that we will not be uh, leaving this place, uh, we can actually calm things down a little bit um, so last time we were able to uh, build much more of our raft uh, we we expanded upwards built our first kind of little cabin here I've uh, got our radio receiver working and we now have reached our first destination uh, that the radio led us to um, and that is this structure right here um, that we have <laughs> kind of crashed into. Um, and we will be exploring that today as soon as we get uh, kind of our inventory situation sorted out a bit here. Um, I need to... Uh, da, 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 da. I need to do a bunch of things. I am... trying to remember what all the goal was here. Okay. Uh, we definitely want some more food. Uh, do we have any more fish? It doesn't really look like it. Uh, unless we had some on the grill, perhaps? Ooh, none of that is cooked. So, we are really just short on planks at the moment, it seems. Um... Our hook is not in great shape either. Uh, oh no, I do have I do have a spare hook made. That is good. I see that further on the hot bar. Ooh, I can't quite reach that plank. And we reach this one. Oh, we are I think just too far away. Uh, that's okay. Uh, we can just eat some of these potatoes for now because we have a bunch in storage and we'll continue to get a bunch more so that's fine um okay so we can put some of that away I'll take some more of that vine goo and keep making some more and then one thing I was kind of curious about uh, is some more kind of equipment stuff that we might want to make for exploration. Uh, so we're not going to need our hammer. Uh, we'll probably leave behind our broken hook just for inventory space. Uh, but we'll take our standard hook, we'll take our spear and our axe. I don't know that we'll actually need our hook or our axe, but I'm going to bring them regardless. Uh, we'll fill up our water bottle before we go. And take that for some water. Uh, we don't need any stones. Uh, we won't need our cup or our paddle. Um, and I think all the rest of this can stay as well. Uh, as far as any other tools, I don't think any of the rest of that looks necessary. Food or water stuff here. No, any other weapons? 
Uh, I don't think so. Uh, flippers. Flippers might be nice for any of the underwater stuff. I do hear the shark out there, but we're just not gonna bother. I don't think I could get to him in time. Um, so we'll make some flippers. And how much does another water bottle cost? Uh, food and water. I'm, I'm losing my mind here. Uh, okay, we can make one more of those. And then, is that, is that all the vine goo? Uh, okay, that's all that we've got for now. Looks like we do have one more plank. I'll put it there just in case that finishes any of our food. And then I think we will put the rest of our items here in storage. Um, let's see, we should put those in there. Um, any of our food we want to bring. Um, let's see. I'll just bring a bunch of beets for food because we've got so many of them that eating some raw is not going to be a problem. And then, right, that's stuff to be smelted. I don't really have a spot for tools at the moment, so we'll throw them in here. Um, and there we go. So the shark will be nibbling on our uh, raft while we are gone, but there's not much we can do about that. I'm gonna use our two bottles here to fill this up for the moment. And then the reason I wanted to keep making bottles is that we are going to actually research this bottle and we can learn a oxygen bottle. And uh, we're not gonna be able to craft this just now, uh, but eventually that'll help us breathe longer underwater. The flippers that we made will help us move faster underwater, uh, which will be pretty good um, with just that even. But... Uh, once we can get the um, that oxygen bottle made as well, that'll be uh, very, very handy. Um, I think I'll go ahead and eat a couple of watermelons here as well, just because we're we're low on uh, both hunger and thirst. And I think with that, we are ready to go. Um, I might go ahead and try to take out the shark, uh, so that we can explore basically from the bottom up, and some of this place is underwater. Um, now I've been getting some comments from you guys, uh, about the shark, um, and basically helping it to stay away longer. Um, once we take this guy out, um, we normally, oh, I totally missed there. Um, we normally collect, uh, the shark meat, and then we get the shark head at the end as a reward. Um, oh, and that happened real quick. Uh, so we get one, two, three, four shark meat, but I'm gonna leave the shark body here. Um, I've got comments from multiple of you guys, uh, saying that if we just leave the shark body there, um, because we did not pick up the shark head, uh, that it'll take longer for a new shark to spawn in. Uh, so we're going to take advantage of that. And uh, that way we can explore underwater here um, a little bit easier without being bothered by a new shark. So I don't remember what all of this as stuff that we can pick up, because I have explored here before. Looks like we can get some scrap. I do need to be aware. Ooh, that's a whole crate. Yeah, I think that's everything in this room. Let's go grab a breath before checking the back. Back corner of there. Uh, but it looks like, ooh, we got a, uh, a juicer recipe. That's pretty cool. 
Uh, but yeah, let's go check the back corner here. Uh, wow, okay. There was literally just a trash can. Um, alright, just double checking, and it does look like we got everything. From what I can tell. Um, so I'll just kind of swim around the outside. I just want to make sure we got all the materials. There aren't any notes, at least on this main platform. Then we might kind of come underneath, peek around, and we can come pick up some of these resources as well. Um, see, those are just rocks. I might grab a bit more sand and clay. I think we used up uh, pretty much all of our sand and clay already. Uh, rocks we don't really need. Scrap is always good. I know we were running low on scrap at one point. Can't remember our current status of it, but the more that we're trying to build up our raft, the more that we will need scrap for uh, nails for nicer building materials. That just looks like regular rocks. Got a nice school of tropical fish here with us. All right. Well, I think that's probably most of the exciting stuff down here below. Um, and then I think it looks like this layer is kind of coming in and out of underwater, so we can check it out without too much danger. And then once we check out this level, we might go. December twelfth. Oh. We stopped for the night. Owl climbed the tower. Radio still works, but it should be two weeks before we reach Selim with the teams not responding. You might say things are a bit tense. The other facilities are underwater, so if Selim is lost, we got nothing. And now Sparrow's not talking to either of us. I really hope we're not the last hope for humanity. Very cool. So that was our first little bit of, of uh, kind of dialogue lore in the game. For those of you who are just joining me for the uh, raft playthrough and haven't been following along uh, with me on Grounded, I do like to stop and, and pay attention to each of the little bits of, of lore that we get um, for the game, so... We'll definitely be trying to pay attention to that and follow along with the story as much as possible. Um, Alright, we are starving a little bit. Let's get that grill going. Alright, that is better. Uh, we can go ahead and drop off some more of this just to free up inventory space while we are here. Um, oh, we got actually a whole new spear. That's nice. Uh, recipes we can throw in there. And our last shark meat I'll just throw in there. All right. Perfect. Okay. Well, we should be good now to uh, explore the upper part of this whole uh, platform. Uh, all right. Caught a shark and named him Bruce. Free 
plastic. January. It's been weeks. Just me an hour here now. Stuck on this platform. Sparrow took the boat. I, I can't figure out why. Everything is just so secret. I mean, I don't even know their real names. I only know the team at Selim got a prototype working and they needed more people. We were supposed to be those people. Together, we would find a way out of this mess. Somehow. Owls yelling up in the tower. Maybe the radio picked up something. Is it you, Sparrow? Interesting. So, like, Cuckoo seems to kind of feel like he's just along for the ride in all of this. Robbie, boat's gone. Bruce is after me. Gonna stay here until I find a way off this place. Mike. That seems like about all in the cabins down here. But we can definitely jump around and get up higher. Okay, that might be all that we can do on this side. Took boat, won't be back. Alright, nothing in that little room. Oh, alright, well we do have a new shark already, but I still think that was probably better. Ooh, we got a headlight blueprint. Owl's radio notes. 22nd of December. Distress call received. Balboa Island. 9th of January. Who won't accept facts? 2nd of February. Gunshots in the distance. Bangaroa City. 14th of February. Sparrows calm. That's a limb. 6th of March, another distress call, Varuna Point. Is he a child? 16th of April, rafters dreaming of utopia. Foolish hope. Alright, so Owl definitely seems very cynical. Especially compared to Cuckoo. else back here. Ah, no, there was just a door. Okay. All right, well, what is out here then? Anything hiding on the back side of this building? Doesn't look like it. Alright, is this climbable? No, it kind of looks like it should be, but... I think... Oh, very good. I think this is our way up. And maybe... Balance on that door, yep. All right, the ocean got much quieter now. Um, I think that's all of our supplies. We're almost to the top. Check out what's in here. Uh, February. We've picked up a lot of signals. Maybe someone will come and help us. 
We're not starving. Yet. Oh. The reactor at Selin might be the only chance we have against this endless ocean. You knew it, Sparrow. Owl thinks you betrayed us, but you must have had a good reason for leaving us here. I hope you make it to Selin. I hope you finish the reactor. For all of us. Oh my gosh, there's a person here. Hello. Hey, a friendly face. Wondering how I ended up here? Long story. Really, really long story. Anyway, nice raft. If you need any repairs done, let me know. I've sort of ended up as a maritime expert, mainly due to the world sinking. Awesome. Let's head out. Nice. Whoa, they just disappeared. That's kind of creepy. Uh, okay. Uh, recycler. Interesting, okay. Um, a new note was added. Um... Okay, we, we've heard all those. Ah, people, there we go. I think that's our new note. Oh, okay, that's just replaying that. Well, forget that. Uh, anything else up there? Oh, we need to drink. Uh, I don't think there's anything else up there. So I think... We should be good to head on back down. That is not too bad at all. I do want to be careful heading down here. I think we could just jump into the water. Uh, let's see, which side's our raft on? I think we're over here. Uh, yes. There we go. And, oh, I don't have a hammer, so I can't repair anything right now. Uh, cool. All right, well, we got some good new stuff. Bad shark, though. Um, we got some good new stuff. Let's see if we can... Uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, recycler and headlamp. Um, and we will... We'll throw those in here for now. Because I'm weird and I like to hold on to my blueprints. And let's see, we can drop our uh, beets back in here. And uh, retrieve some of our old tools again. And I think that ought to do it. So, before we take off, let's see if we can... Okay, we can't quite repair everything. Uh, but that's alright. Let's lift up our anchor, or remove our anchor, that is. Uh, head back up top. And at least for now, just try to get off... Uh, okay, wind's blowing like that way. We just need to get off of this thing. Yeah, 
And I'm trying to turn us around so that we go with the wind as much as possible. There we go, that's pretty good. Not bad at all. Alright, so. Uh, yeah, let's, let's grab a bite to eat. And a little sip to drink. And okay, what was that in our journal? So, we completed the radio tower. Now we're heading to the Vis Uh, so that's 9174. 9. 1. 7. 4. Alright, well we're heading in pretty well the right direction. We just angle slightly to the left. That ought to be pretty darn good. And we can power that down for now. And uh, say goodbye to the radio tower there. So that is our first main story stop knocked out. Um, okay, so. What now? Um, we definitely are, are gonna keep moving toward our next main stop, that is for sure. Um, but we also need to keep improving our raft. Um, the big thing that we need right now is a permanent anchor, because it is becoming a pain to start and stop uh, with... Um, by crafting those temporary anchors all the time. So let's see uh, what it'll take. Really, it's just going to be getting planks, because rope is not a problem for us at all. And uh, we're actually in a decent spot right now to be collecting uh, more things drifting by. Uh, I still need to keep repairing as we go, but, um, this is, this is good. That's not good, though. Can't be having backwards progress with, uh, shark attacks. So I think today, uh, especially if we can get this anchor built, uh, we probably will stop at any islands that we see, uh, because wood has definitely been our most scarce resource now that we're expanding the raft a lot. And so being able to chop down any trees uh, is definitely going to be a help uh, with moving forward here. Try to get some of our other kind of production things restocked up with planks as we can as well. Oh, we do have an island off to the left. Alright, 
right, so that is enough now to build the anchor. If I grab our rope, which I think we're just going to grab that. And, okay, three ingots and a hinge. All right, so we can craft our stationary anchor. Um, the only other thing about this is figuring out where the heck we want to put this. Because the stationary anchor is rather large. And it's going to require a hole in the boat. Um, so we technically could put it kind of in our little cabin here. Uh, if we busted a hole through the floor. But I think that we're going to want to maybe do this outside somewhere. Um, we could leave a gap uh, somewhere in our kind of collection uh, little row and put it up front. But I think maybe we expand out the back just a bit. And, uh, do it there. It is gonna mean that we have to build more. But, that's okay. We seem to be making pretty good progress. And, I think that we are gonna maybe try to head over to this island over here. Um, oh, we are running low on our essentials. Um, I actually am going to sleep real quick so we can have daylight, especially as we approach this island. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay, and we needed plastic. Uh, let's go ahead and do our decoration package. And motivational quote. Got a few of those, I believe. Alright. Now it's wood that we need again. Big surprise. No! Bad. I may have to grab our grab our paddle again. If we want to make this Come on. All right. We're going to drop that anchor there. Just because the paddle broke, we're not going to get any closer by our own effort. There we go. We can at least fix that in so the shark can't like destroy this whole thing with one bite. Uh, there we go. But yeah, that's that's the uh, the anchor in use. Um, so now we can just raise and lower the anchor, 
with uh, with one button push, and that is way nicer than what we had before. Um, and since this is a bit of a swim, you know what? We're just gonna go ahead and uh, deal with our shark problem. Especially now that we know we can prolong our our shark time. Eventually, we won't want to use this trick because we'll want to be collecting shark heads. Uh, but that'll be a good while uh, before the shark heads are actually useful. And my goodness, we're actually doing way better um, killing the shark with our, our metal spears. It's going a lot faster than what I even am anticipating because we hadn't really attacked that shark very much yet. Only two or three times off of our raft. We will come take all of these planks. And I won't complain about watermelon either. Anything over on this side? Nothing over here. Alright, I think this is the last of really the main island stuff. We at least did get a different island this time instead of just getting like the same island over and over again. Uh, like we did the other day. Uh, let's see, yeah, we, we can go ahead and do some diving here. Good, that finally used up the last little bit of our old hook. And I think really what we should be after is some metal ore. Oh yeah, and we are swimming so much faster now. We can dive to these depths with ease. Uh, okay, we are out of inventory space. Uh, here, we can... Let's eat that. And... Do that. And we'll see how far that gets us. We just won't be able to make a huge trip here. What else do we need? So I'm curious, um, and you guys have been really helpful in, in the comments for me, so I'm hoping that y'all have some advice for me here. Uh, I'm curious if there is any benefit to collecting stones that I am unaware of, because really the main thing is like the basic version of tools um, and the basic anchors from what I remember. Um, am I like totally forgetting something that I should be collecting uh, those basic just like stones for and making sure I stock up on that 
Or am I totally good right now to be ignoring stones like I have been? If you guys can let me know in the comments, I would really appreciate it. Um, I definitely... Like, I've played Raft before. Um, a fair amount. But, like, I'm actually just gonna, for now, drop those on the ground. Okay, nail, stew, plank... One plank is probably not worth it. Uh, that's a stew recipe, okay. Uh, honestly, I have so many palm leaves that that's not... A hinge is more... valuable there. Uh, one nail's not worth it. Okay. Anything else fun here? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Uh, but yeah. Uh, if you guys know of any, like, thing that I should be saving up stones for, let me know. Because otherwise I'm just gonna keep ignoring them like I have been. I'll save up the ones that I get from, like, barrels and stuff. Because I'm a hoarder. So it does pain me to be leaving stuff back there, but my inventory is full at the moment. I am excited for the day, even though it is a long way away, that we get a backpack. Curious. All right, so our shark body has despawned, so I don't think that there is much time left without it. I think that it's just time to move along. Let's go ahead and point ourselves in a better direction here. I think I see an abandoned raft right, right there on the edge of the screen on the right side. So we're going to maybe head in that direction. Um, let's see. Good, I didn't have this particular recipe. And we can put this stuff away now. Let's go start cooking up some meat because I am getting hungry. Uh, we should keep making some vine goo so that we can make that breather. Uh, and actually, we might have enough. So I need a water bottle. And then oxygen. Craft. Boom. There we go. Now our underwater adventures will be even more efficient. Alright, we totally miss misaligned our sails for that that raft, but that's okay. Oh, there's the goo for us. Cool. Uh, let's go ahead and get some metal cooking up. And I think we'll save the rest of that as seaweed. And let's get the rest of this put away. Right, though that sand is to turn into glass. Ooh, rope. And I'll actually take that, that away, and we're good. Okay. Ooh, some more fishies down there. And we are coming up, actually, almost dead ahead on another island, so that's good news. And then here in the back, we can just fill that in with regular old planks. 
And we are in pretty good shape back here. The only thing is that this anchor is on like three edges. And if we moved it more toward the middle, we could at least lower that number. Uh, so we might want to do that here pretty soon. Yes, I know. We're very hungry. Okay. All right. So I'm also curious, while we're just kind of floating along here, uh, what we can do in terms of improving our food situation. Um, we've got these two cooking tables here. Um, and I kind of want to try them both out. Uh, the cooking pot I've used before, but the juicer is new. But hopefully we can make them both. Because uh, we're starting to get recipes for both. Uh, so we need a uh, metal ingots bolt and vine goo... Another bolt and vine goo, and a circuit board. Uh, so the circuit board's the most complicated there. Um, but this one we can definitely make right now. I can do that and just grab the vine goo. And cook pot. We can just kind of continue with our cooking area right here and uh, let's grab our recipes here's our two cook pot recipes that we have so far and then let's see we need Um, we need a bolt, uh, three more vine goo, and a circuit board. Three vine goo, and a circuit board. I don't actually remember what a circuit board takes, but I know there's some copper. Uh, and more vine goo. And more copper. Okay, well, we're gonna miss the island that I was hoping we would kind of hit, but that's all right. All right, I'm actually gonna rotate this just to be in line with the other stuff. Oh, I know, it's so hard. Uh, oh, and then these need to be refueled as well. And while we wait for that vine goo, actually, first we're going to stop the shark attack. And then I want that barrel that we saw drifting by. That should let us heal that up. And eh, we'll go ahead and heal it all the way, whatever. All right, one, two, three. Now we just need one more in there. So we can make a circuit board. And come on, Vangu. I should probably actually get more, more of this ready. Since we're using a decent amount of Vangu. Alright. 
So now, if we go back to our cooking section, juicer. Well, now we're out of planks. That's awkward. Um, now we have enough, uh, but there's another barrel that I want. Oh, but I missed it. I'm out of practice again, everybody. There we go. All right, now we've got plenty. Let's try this again. Juicer. Ooh, that's a fun-looking machine. Uh, oh, you require a battery. Well. All right, now what? Uh, copper scrap. Let's, let's keep, let's keep up in our copper supply, too, then. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. but I'm impatient, so we'll take one. We'll take one more scrap. We'll make a battery. And we'll put it in there. Okay. But I want, I want that, I want that barrel. Oh, see, it had a decoration package. It's like I knew. Because how would we have lived without that funky-looking shelf? All right. Uh, now we can grab our smoothie recipes. And there's the mango nana, which we don't have any of the stuff for except for a little bit of it. And the red melon, which we have half of the stuff for. Well... Um, that's fun. I don't know that we can use our juicer then. I was really excited about that. Well, hopefully we'll find some more... Uh, juice recipes that are a little bit more beginning of the game friendly. Uh, what am I looking for? You know what? We really need more seaweed. But yeah, I would I would love to be able to make smoothies just because or juices because that's that sounds so fun. Uh, we can make. Uh, some soups or stews, though. Uh, the vegetable soup would be really easy. But simple fish stew sounds like more fun. Do we have any fish caught at the moment? We don't. Let's go fishing. Oh my goodness, look at all this stuff. some mackerel. I don't remember if that was one of the usable ones. I know we can use the palm for it. However you pronounce it. I'm pretty confident that that's not how you pronounce it. The circle bluey fish. Tilapia. Hello, shark. No! How dare you! You're inside my raft eating my raft. That's just rude. Oh, that was a good catch right there. Um, all right, let's let's go check which fish we needed. Uh, I think none of the fish that we have. Cool. We're catching too fancy of fish. But we can still grill our fish, so you know that's that's always a plus. A herring, we can we can use that. We'll just need one more.
It's basically the same stuff that we would be using to make shark bait. And there's another herring, cool. Eh. Come on, fish. Come on, fish. All right, well, there was a third herring, so I'm gonna call that worth it. Oh, but I'm gonna miss the barrel. No, I'm not. You all were worried about nothing. Okay. Um, oh, but there's another barrel. Oh, we have, we have so many decorations we need to open. Uh, cupboard. Cupboard's good. Uh, another table. It's like our fourth one, and a, a fifth table as well. I don't actually know how many tables we're at, but we're gonna go with it. Okay. Let's put some herring down, and then either potatoes or beets. Uh, well, we've actually got beets on us, so... Oh, uh, we had potatoes on us too, literally in the hot bar. Well... How about that? Oh, the pot does a little dance. That's fun. Cool. Well, we'll let it do its thing. Uh, let's also just cook up some regular old mackerel while we're at it. Um, alright, we are quite thirsty. Uh, let's go ahead and cycle through this. Very good. Alright, we've got a pretty good rhythm of stuff going now. Alright, so I'm also curious, um... One of the things we got was a recycler. Combines basic resources into trading post currency, so we need to make another circuit board. And then have some more metal on us. Okay. Ooh, our soup is ready. Um, alright, so... Yada yada yada. Can we make one? We can. Uh, craft! There we go. Recycler. Oh my, that is large. Uh. Uh. You can go by the smelters for now. Um, have we reached the island yet? Basically, kind of. Let's make sure we're ready here by our anchor as I fall into the water. Get a little closer. That should be good enough. Alrighty, see this is just so much nicer. Uh, cool. So... You need a battery. Well, our juicer is not going to be useful for a while, so congratulations, you get the juicer battery. Um... Nope. No. I did not say it was shark time. I'll deal with you later. Alright, so I'm making something. Oh! It went boom. Oh, it's still going boom. Interesting. Are 
you gonna do anything or do you need more stuff? Do you want to beat? No, you don't want to beat. Wait, why, why are you at 90% health? I was looking through that somehow. That was weird. Okay, that was that was super confusing. Uh, okay. Oh, it made a thing. I've got a trash cube. Can I research you? No. It's so cute! Oh, I can't hold it. Uh, cool! Well, we made trash, everybody. Which is kind of funny that the recycler makes trash, but, you know, that's, that's cool too. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll put it in here. Um, excellent. Uh, let's, let's throw everything in their respective chests and go do some things. Uh, da, 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 da. Um, I really should get some refreshed tools though, because our hook is not in great shape, our spear is about to break, luckily we do have a replacement one of those. Um, I might keep that in my back pocket just in case. Um, okay, what do we need for a new hook? Uh, four planks. Okay. Well, that's good enough for now. All right. Uh, we'll go deal with the shark and uh, carry on with exploring this little island. Thanks for dealing with my little recycler distraction. I get gamer ADHD and... You know, something just pops in my head, and... I go, squirrel! Oh, yeah, so, uh, we've got our, our mask on now. You can see my oxygen level is depleting, like, super slowly. All right, and there's our shark meat. Uh, so the biggest thing underwater I actually want right now is seaweed. Uh, wow, that was a ton of seaweed plants with no actual seaweed. That is disappointing. We'll be sure to actually grab the copper this time. Last time my inventory was full and I could not actually grab any. But we've been using some to make various mechanical components with our juicer that we can't use because we don't have recipes that we can fulfill. And our recycler now that makes trash. Alright, let's go ahead and take a breath. We don't need to push it too far. Here we go, here's all the actual seaweed.
I suppose that maybe rocks could be good for that, like, uh, recycler. There could still be something better for the recycler than rocks. I don't know. It still may not be worth collecting them by diving, and maybe it's still better to do it just by getting them from, uh... You know, the ones I naturally get in... Uh, barrels. Um... But yeah, I'm, I'm curious to see what you guys have to say about that. And also, on that note, thank you all so much for your incredible support on this raft series. Um, I really wasn't sure how it was going to go as I was starting my second survival game playthrough on the channel. Um, especially, like, while I'm still going through Grounded. And, uh... You all have been seriously showing out and uh, really, really showing this a lot of love. And uh, it has absolutely meant the world to me. Um, I have actually been like fairly sick the last couple of uh, last couple of weeks over the Christmas holiday, uh, conveniently enough. And um, uh, being able to, like, see all your guys' comments and, and, uh, all of that coming in with your support for, um, really, for this series in particular has been, uh, really awesome to see and has really lifted my spirits, uh, as I've not been feeling great, so, um, yeah, I just wanted to say I really appreciate you guys and, uh, it's been, it's been awesome to see the support, um, so, thank you all so much for uh, supporting the channel, supporting the series, and um, I'm glad to see that you all are getting some enjoyment from it. Um, and definitely, for those of you who are maybe just joining the channel through this Raft playthrough, um, I've also been doing another survival game um, playthrough of Grounded. Um, it's, uh, it's another survival series, um, or another survival game. Oh no, my inventory is full. Um, another survival game with, uh, honestly, not too dissimilar of a graphical style. Um, but, uh, it's kind of premise, uh, is that you are, um, shrunk down to the size of an ant and are surviving uh, in a backyard, and I won't say much more than that, um, to not spoil it if you haven't either played the game or want to go watch my playthrough, um, but yeah, definitely check that out if you want to see some more of another survival game. I've been really enjoying that game as well, um, All right, I think we've got most of this unloaded. We at least can probably go back in and get the last of the materials. I did see sharks swimming around, so I will definitely be sticking to the surface here. Um, oh, did I actually get all the trees? I did. But I think it was maybe just the fruits that I was missing. Where was that? One item I dropped. There it is! Watermelon seeds. Gotta stock up for the eventual garden. I think that's actually all that I wanted from the remainder of this island. think, let's see, I will grab all this stuff, and I think that we can go ahead and cast off once again. Uh, we can put this and this away. Let's go ahead and get our inventory straightened back out over here. Um, put that away. And lift up our anchor. 
And how are we doing as far as steering? Oh my. Alright, so we're still a long way off. I'm curious if I, like, overshot by a lot. I have not been checking our position. But we need to head pretty far to the right. And I want to kind of overcorrect, I think. Alright. Well, I think that we are headed off in the right direction for our next stop. Um, let's go ahead and get... Oops, heading the wrong side here. Let's go ahead and get some meat on the grill. Eat up some of this. And uh, I think, looking at the time... I've actually gone a little bit over today, but uh, it is time to wrap things up. Um, I know that we didn't get uh, too much really changed uh, as far as the uh, footprint of our raft. We did get a little bit of a back deck here, mostly just to put the anchor on. Um, but we did make at least a little bit of good story progress by um, exploring uh, the radio tower, our first stop crossed off here in our journal um, and uh, at least inside our little cabin here things are a lot more interesting with uh, some new food production um, hopefully we'll be able to use our juicer soon because I'm very excited about that and uh, we have a, a fancy trash cube maker so um, yeah I think that that will do it for today so, uh, yeah, as always, thank you guys once again for coming along on this sea voyage with me. Um, I really do appreciate all of your support. Um, definitely, uh, be sure to let me know down in the comments. Do I need to be collecting stones for anything? Because I'm so curious about that now that I'm up to, like, you know, like, metal tools. Because um, you guys have been super helpful in the comments for me already. Um, but yeah, other than that, make sure that you are subscribed so that you can find the next episode. And I will see you all very soon for some more Raft.